my fireball whiskey ribs. Let's make these. So we're going to start off by trimming the fat and the membrane off your ribs. Now just cut them up. Next, get a boiling pan of water, drop in a stock cube, and some apple juice. And then, season. Once stock cubes dissolved, chuck in your meat. Next, get yourself a wire rack and a baking tray like this one. Make some bio from Kitchen Attics. Get your ribs, I'm just gonna put them on the rack. Just let them drain off for a little bit. So they were boiling for about an hour, an hour and a quarter. We just let them rest and drain for a little bit while we get the rub together. So get yourself a bowl. And in your bowl, you're gonna add some chili powder, some garlic powder, some paprika, some onion powder, and some brown sugar. Just give that a mix. Now we're going to get our ribs and put them into the roux. Now just give them a good toss. Try and get all your meat coated in the roux. Now get your baking tray, just line it with foil. Just get your ribs out. We're just going to place them on the tray. Once on the tray, any excess, Going to sprinkle it over the top. Next, get yourself an apple and just chop it up in bits. And put those bits on top. Then we're just going to wrap this up. Get it nice and tight and well covered up. Preheat your oven to 180. We're going to slam this in for about an hour. So for the glaze, get yourself a bowl and we're going to put in some honey. So into the honey goes our fireball whiskey liqueur. It's delicious. Pour that in. And then give it a mix. A mix. So after an hour, get the ribs out. And wrap them. Be careful of the steam. Ooh, so we have a look at these. Nice and moist. So we're going to take the apples out. Once the apples are out, Get your glaze, I'm just going to brush all over the ribs. Get plenty on. Don't forget to flip them over and do both sides. Now brush both sides, we've got plenty in the bottom. We'll stick those back in for about another 10 minutes. So they are out, it's time to play them. And there they are, my fireball whiskey ribs.